So I don't know if this is every Wimpy Kid board game, but I got the major ones. So let's start with the first one that's already opened. It's called the Wimpy Kid 10 Second Challenge. Here's the back of it. Let's open it up. It comes with this board right here. Instructions. You got a big deck of cards right here. Oh my God. God, great, that was actually a fail. I wasn't even trying to do that. Three dice, an hourglass, a blue ball, and then all the Wimpy Kid characters. Even Manny, which I should just throw in the trash, but I'll keep it. So the idea of the game is to be the first player to go around the game board, starting and ending at the start and finish space. You go around the game board doing challenges along the way. Some of the challenges are draw a scary picture, throw a ball in the air and clap five times, stuff like that. Basically, if you make it around the board, first you win pretty simple board game but they made a board game out of diver wimpy kids so you got to give them props for that right there i think the board looks colorful and also i like the characters that they give you obviously they're from the book but they're just cool you can almost display this on a shelf or something another thing that's pretty interesting is that it includes original illustrations by jeff kenny so he went in and drew new drawings for the cards which is pretty cool that he put in that much effort for a board game let's move on to the next wimpy kid game so if for these next ones, I've never opened yet. Yeah! And here it is in the box. Let's take it out. So this one's called Diary of a Wimpy Kid, Don't Scramble the Egg Game. I've always seen this one, but I never owned it. I never owned any of the Wimpy Kid board games, actually. And if you're wondering, I got all of these off of eBay. So it has the instructions, the deck of cards, and the big egg. Oh my god. Oh, oh! So this one actually came out in 2012, and I'm guessing it's based off the book The Ugly Truth, because it has an egg on the cover. The object of this game is to be the last player left when all the other players are out of the game. So here's what you have to do. The player will pick up a card and read the category. Then you're gonna turn on the egg and pass it around, but before you pass it, you have to name something from that category. For example, I picked up playground equipment, so I would have to turn it on, then I would have to say swings, for example, Toss it to someone else, and you have to say something before the egg cracks. Just like that. Very simple game, but I bet it provides hours of fun. Guys, make sure to get the seventh Wimpy Kid book. It's coming out in 2012. <laughs> Third Wimpy Kid game. This is the Diver Wimpy Kid puzzle. It's actually never been open. I didn't even know that. It still has the original plastic on it. So there it is right there. It's a pretty big puzzle. And it's got all the Wimpy Kid characters and stuff on it. On the back, it has puzzles from each of the books, probably at the time. It only goes up to dog days. But this is kind of cool that it's never been open. This came out in 2010, and it's never been open. So that means 12 years later, I'm going to be the first to open this. I almost don't want to do it, but it's not going to be worth anything. I have to do it for the video. <laughs> it's like stuck it hasn't been open in so long this is actually nice because now i know that all the pieces will be in there because it's still in the plastic so basically it's a wimpy kid puzzle i really can't explain much more than that and a lot of you probably want to see me solve this but there's two things one that'll take forever and two i'm terrible at doing puzzles maybe i'll do it someday but i just kind of want to leave it in there you can look around you can see all the characters and stuff i didn't even know that look at it it has two 200 pieces in here. But if you're a fan of the series, I'm sure you'll love it. I'm just not gonna do it right now. But don't cry, because we still have one last board game to open up. This is the weirdest packaging I ever saw. It didn't come in a box, just bubble wrap. Hey, I mean, I guess that's one way to do it. Of course, I have to do it. Oh my God, it's so not satisfying. This is a pretty big one. It's called Diver Wimpy Kid Cheese Touch Board Game. I think this one's the most popular one. I may be wrong, but from what I've seen, a lot of people know this one. Dang, they have that just thrown in there. So it has the instructions that are a little bent. Here's the board game. Man, look at this. All the cards are just thrown in there and like bent. I guess that's what I get for buying it on eBay, but hey, look at this. It also came with a free dime. I got 10 cents back on it, I guess. So it comes with the same type of characters that you saw in the other board game. From what I see, it looks like everything's in here. It was just sloppily put in there. The object of this game is to be the first player to reach the finished space without the cheese touch. So you roll the dice and move ahead that many spaces on the 
a board game. Depending on what you land on, you have to pick a card and do that thing. So there's things like who said what, do it like this, yes or no, great minds think alike, and randomness spaces and cards. And you only win by landing on the finished space without ever getting the cheese touch. And if you happen to get the cheese touch, you can get rid of it by winning one of the challenges. So if you land on great mind thinks alike and you get the question right, you can get rid of it. I mean, I'm not exactly sure because I never played this game, but I'm just going off what the instructions say. I would say this one's a lot more complicated than the other ones. There's a lot of stuff that comes with it, like cards and all, but the board game doesn't seem too big. I mean, there's the start, there's the end. You just go around. I guess you want to play this with a lot of people. Also, it comes with the cheese itself, so that's a nice touch. There you guys go. That's every Wimpy Kid board game that I can get my hands on. Also, I might as well show this. I almost forgot. This really doesn't count as a board game, but it's the Wimpy Kid Mad Libs. Hope you enjoyed, and I'm out.